I'm not the only one in the world that wakes up in the morning and the first sort of thought is, what's the least painful way to get out of bed? <laughs> Instead of screaming and throwing bricks at the wall, we just put every positive intent and action into meeting whatever need came along. Patients helping patients, that's what it's all about. I call myself an actionist. People are dying. We can't wait anymore. We are an outreach and, and a community group, and we're here for social change. It's not about stoner culture, it's about shifting that paradigm from moving away from the idea of stoner culture into the medicinal and healing properties for which cannabis has been used for, for thousands of years. Cannabis is a community. We're working with kids, young adults, adults, seniors, horses, dogs. They're bringing their pets. You wanna know something? I bet you I can help you. Hi folks, I'm just Rob. I'm not the cannabis guru or Grey Bruce, right? <laughs> not every other name or label that you've given me. This is your healing journey. Once I've done what I can do, then it's your choice as to what you do with this information and how you use it. We start you gentle, you get a counselor, you'll work with them, they'll bring you up to a program. Once you're good, God love you, go help your friends and neighbors. If you'd have told me 30 years ago as I was you know, sparking up a joint, that we'd have a bunch of old ladies sitting in a public place learning how to make things with cannabis. I would have just laughed at you. We're not dealers, we're healers. And we're not preachers, we're teachers. It's not grannies hitting bongs. I got introduced to a plant by two freaky hippies that look like Cheech and Chong. Got great big hugs. Not asked for a bloody thing. And my life got changed. My doctor says, I don't want to know what you're doing, but you don't even have to take an aspirin. There's nothing wrong with me now. It was just awesome. It was the first time that he, you know, the doctors looked at me and said, you're cancer free, right? I was so afraid that I was going to get thrown back in the States because of what he was doing. But now I don't care. And it took the love of one little girl is where this all started was with Angelina. Angelina was perfectly healthy until she suffered her first seizure. Okay, let's lie her down. Oh, Jesus. It's heartbreaking. I got in contact with Gary, which then supplied me with a, a bottle of tincture, and we went seizure-free for about 45 days. You can't control us now because we've spread the word. It's not about the party high anymore. It's about truly being helpful. Mother Earth natural design. Teaching folks that there's a better way than pharmaceutical drugs. Cannabis saves lives. Ripple, ripple.